What's up guys, this is RGV, another High Definition Broadcast, as you can see we're here on Unison League, and we are doing the Apollo video. Uh, right now you can see me setting up my skills for the video. I am going to be taking a Dual Sword, I think it's called. Yeah, Dual Sword, um, Divine Strike, no, Divine Smash, um, Balance, and Mass Refresh. Um, and basically I'm just, you know, setting it up right before I get in. Uh, the first wave... It's just basically a beat him down, attack whoever your um, your team is first attacking. I usually we usually go top down, so that's how uh, we do that. In terms of um, priority targets for the first, you don't really need to uh, go crazy, um, and the healer usually gonna save most of their mana here. Obviously, you want to kill the Leo first on this one, so burst attack. Uh, use your damage uh, as fast as you can. Uh, you want him to uh, die before he uses his um, mirror, which he did there. So, a good way to do it is burst attacking, saving your uh, attack for when your friends are attacking as well. So that's something that you do. This guy you want to kill before he uses his final uh, strike, I think it's called. Final strike or final blow. Um, it basically, it, it takes you down to 1 HP. Uh, so you want to make sure you kill him before that. The dull hand captain, obviously you want to kill him before he does his mirror reflect as well. Right now I'm just getting a uh, water valk out just to get a high amount of DPS on myself because as you know um, the soldiers attacks um, dual strike or dual, dual str uh, sword and um, divine smash both go off of attack and defense. So yeah, that's why I did my uh, blue valk first. Also gonna give a good amount of damage to my teammates. Right now um, we are playing the safe route, putting our kagatsushi up first, as well as getting our haste up so that our cost regeneration is higher and our unison gain is higher as well. Having a three proc haste, which is gonna give us a level two haste, um, is going to give us a good amount of uh, unison gain so that we can get our unison up really quickly and get those buffs up uh, back to or to 8 so if we can get a 80% buff on all stats that is always going to be very good uh, so in terms of this uh, level 4 uh, you don't really doesn't really matter too much who you're attacking first um, as you know these guys really go down pretty quickly but you know my guild does have a high amount of damage so that's how that worked um, these guys yeah you usually just go top down whoever the first target is you just kill him um, you definitely do not want to leave any of these guys at low HP's because again they can use their final flash on you and then you'll you'll die um, at this point I actually chose to go um, to go haste as well because having four uh, haste skinning proct is going to give us a little three haste and it's going to give us a huge amount of unison gain and um, and cost regeneration so th that's just something that I chose to do you could choose to go um, double blue valk and then you can have an eight buff that'll last a little bit longer but as you can see our, our uh, eight buff is already up and it'll last for not very long at all because it just came off right now but um Look at our unison gain right now, guys. Our unison gain is very high, and uh, that other blue valk that's going to be coming up will probably be done maybe by the end of this round, but um, certainly by very uh, quickly in the beginning of the next round. There you go. So as you can see, Jared does have his unison up right now. He could choose to use his blue valk now, or you can uh, he can choose to wait for Yuki to get his unison. So now would be a good time to pop another haste or save it for another one. Look, I used my Mass Refresh right as the um, Fire Drake used his Berserk. Usually the Berserk will take out a little bit more than um, one person with their Confuse. So you need to make sure you're uh, popping that Mass Refresh right before. It looks like uh, on this run I actually chose to use um, the double double refresh instead of uh, balance but most of the time you want to run one balance and mash refresh instead of doing the um, 
double refresh sometimes you like uh it's good to use double refresh especially if somebody else doesn't have mass refresh or refresh but um usually it's okay uh to go uh to go double refresh um but in, 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 say, like, pubs, you want to go balance and mass refresh. So basically, Apollo is just getting shredded. Summer Surfing, this is where you want to use your balance right here. Um, and then Explosive is where is where you get um, paralyzed. So as you can see, I popped my blue Valk as soon as I paralyzed one off. And then if I see him use an Explosive again, I will use another one of my refreshes. Um, if the healer gets refresh, I mean, gets... Um, exploded or used explosive paralyzed on it is pretty detrimental to the whole team explosive there it is again so as you can see he used area recovery and I used mash refresh a little bit late there so anytime the the boss is using explosive you want to use mash refresh or refresh on the healer and then anytime the boss is using summer surfing or like I think it's called like super summer surfing or something you want to use balance so those are the, those are what the buffs called. The buffs called are uh, summer surfing or super summer surfing, and then the other thing you need to look out for there ex is explosive, which is the paralyze. So take that off your healer as soon as possible, using a pre um, pre skill or a skill that you want to use before that. Um, this one is a run that um, right the run right afterwards. I'll show you the beginning of the boss fight. Um, okay, so does he use, let me see real quick if this guy uses Berserk this round. So Searing Edge, you're looking for um, the Drake to use Berserk. It looks like he's not even going to use Berserk this time. Nope, Flame Boost. So I didn't even get to use um, my Mass Refresh on that one. And then here we go with Apollo. It's coming right up on this second run here and we're just looking for him to use explosive or for him to use uh sweet summer surfing or summer surfing whatever so we actually chose to use a haste unison here um and the fine actually is going to take off the uh, debuffs and status ailments so that's actually pretty good and Myself and Jared both have blue valves as you saw from the last video so we can actually take off the explosive pretty easily That's why I decided to use balance on this one So I'm watching Apollo watching Apollo sunshine is just a damage skill watching him seeing if he's gonna use his buff There it is summer surfing. So as you can see I'm have my uh, cursor highlighted around my um, or Hovering above my balance there Took off the uh, prohibitation with that and look, ticks off his buff straight away. My sunshine would do a lot of damage. I'm thinking, should I use my uh, mash refresh? I see that um, Jared didn't actually get himself with that, so I decided to do it. And then I use my um, my blue valk because it's gonna give us buffs right now. It'll heal us, and then it'll give time for uh, Henry right there to get his balance cost up so that he can balance the boss. So that's the reason I popped my uh, unison at that point. As you can see, uh, he does have buffs on him, six six buffs, and there's the balancing going off on Henry there. So that's pretty much what sealed the deal. We we're gonna win the match at that point. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for the Apollo run, guys. If you guys have any questions, comments, or if you would uh, like, comment, and subscribe, that would be really appreciated, and I would uh, encourage you to do so. Um, so I think that's about it for this one guys definitely uh, catch me on the next one Thank you guys for watching as always and take it easy peace